Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed my YouTube channel yet, please click the subscribe button and the bell icon for more videos. Furniture, household equipment usually made of wood, metal, plastic, marble, glass, fabric or related materials and having a variety of different purposes. Furniture range widely from the simple paint chest or stick back country chair to the most elaborate work cabinet or gold plated console table. The functional and decorative aspects of furniture have been emphasized more or less throughout history according to the economic and fashion. Chairs are always for sitting in. But some are more comfortable or highly ornamented than others. Accessory furnishing are similar subsidiary items such as clocks, mirrors, fireplaces, paneling and other items complementary to an interior scheme. Metal Metals have been used since antiquity for making and ornamenting furniture such as the thrones and stools that were found in the tomb of the youthful Tuntanatum were rich in the gold mount. In ancient greens, bronze, iron and silver were used for making furniture, while that were brains in the ashes of Pompeii. In Italy, include a table with folding underframe and beds made partly or entirely of metal. Throughout the Middle Age, the metal chair, for example, the 7th century throne belonging to first Dagoberate, king of the Frank, was used for special ceremonies. Various examples of silver furniture have been preserved. Not solid metal, they consist of embossed or hammered plates of silver first paint to a wooden core. In the times of war, the silver mountings were melted down and turned into silver coins. It was thus that all the silver furniture disappeared from the royal places of France. During the 18th and 19th centuries, Iron furniture became a typical industrial product. Iron beds in particular became popular because they could be easily folded up. They were much in demand as camp beds. As ordinary beds in private homes or hotels, they could be decorated with brass ornaments such as big knobs fruit onto their post. Iron has also been used for chairs. For instance, rocking chairs or perhaps more frequently, garden chairs that can stand out in the rain, protected only by the cord of paint. The possibilities of steel for furniture were explored in Germany during the 1920s Notably that architectures associated with the Bauhaus, where architects, designers and artists experimented with modern materials. Experiments were made with steel spring and chromium plated steel tubing. The category was soon imitated and tube shaped steel furniture became a symbol of functionalism. Since then, thinner tubing and plated wire with the resilience similar to that found in wicker work chairs have been used because of its lightness aluminium become a furniture material. Metal, however, is still employed mainly for locks, mount and things used on furniture or for purely ornamental purpose. In the Middle Age, simply constructed chests demanded extensive use of iron bands to provide extra strength. 
and the end of these band were cut off from decorative shapes. Cabinets were decorated with mounts of bronze. Inlaid objects decorated with materials such as wood or ivory set into the surface of veneer furniture made at royal furniture workshops in France were marked in an elaborate style of pattern. They were influenced by Asian tradition, in which blue-tempered steel, brass and copper were normally used. In the 17th and 18th centuries, especially in England and the American colonies, a refined style for furniture mounts, ornamental sheet around a keyhole, heights and the like all based largely of Chinese model was developed. The design of these mounts was dictated by clear functional purpose in contrast to contemporary French mounts the majority of which were ornamental, often at the expense of utility. French bronze founders displayed great skill in making purely decorative mounts for the bodies of chests of drawers and protective mounts for corners and legs. Advantages of metal furniture First one is green environmental protection. The raw material of metal furniture is called raw steel plate. With the rise of the iron and steel industry of the Green Revolution and zero energy of the production process, from the selection of metal material to the production process and after elimination will not lead to the waste of resource to the society and will not have influence on the ecological environment is friendly, reusable and sustainable development of resource products. Second one is fire prevention. Fire is mainly reflected in the metal furniture can withstand the test of fire so that the loss to a minimum. The more suitable for the southern region. Metal furniture moisture can solve the problem of people. In addition, the metal furniture can be used outdoors which is more widely used than the traditional wooden furniture. Third advantage is functional diversity. Because of cold roll sheet strength, metal furniture after processing the bending process can meet the functional requirements of many aspects multi drawer mobile simple many advantages can do in different products in addition many varieties of welded metal furniture and pile assembly firm durable and can save space disadvantage of metal furniture the texture is hard and cold. The raw material of metal furniture is iron and this kind of cold roll steel sheet, the physical characteristic of the hard and cold characteristic of steel furniture and this kind of characteristic and people choice of the texture of the form of the different. Therefore, metal furniture is often rejected because of the texture of many people but with the concept of change and fashion product ideas, more and more people like to buy metal furniture. I hope you like the video. Thank you for watching. See you.